Hi, this is iPad for Real Dudes, and today I'm going to be showing you this week's Tweak of the Week, Loctopus. Now, this is a very simple tweak that um is kind of like an app that is like iProtect or Lockdown Pro. Um, this just locks your apps, but um, it's pretty much the nicest one out there. It's really easy and simple, so I'm going to show you how to get it for free. You're going to go to Manage, Sources, Edit, and Add and either add the iHacks repo or the Insanely I repo. I'll have the source code to the left and in the description. And once you're done, you're going to go to search and search Loctopus. Now, here, um, I'm going to show you the one from Insanely I. Don't click on the blue one. And now, you're going to install it. And confirm. Then you're going to want to restart your springboard. So once you're spring, you're going to get this message that says your password is right now is password. So um, to access the settings, you're going to go into your settings app and scroll down to where it says Loctopus. Now from here, you can change your master password. So the old password is password. And I'll make my new password Bob. So right now it changed my password and now I can go and lock my apps. So the way to lock an app is to hold down the app and then on the bottom left hand corner you see a little lock so just press the little lock so it turns red and then press your home button and then once you press the home button you can click on your app and bam it's going to ask you for your password. So, if I type in my password, it's going to launch my app. So, it's just really, really easy tweak, and there's no way to really see that there even is a password, unless you click on here. It's, uh, it's just a really nice, very secure way, and probably the best method out there to protect your apps. So, thanks for watching. And that concludes this week's episode of the Tweak of the Week. Subscribe for the weekly tweak videos coming out every Friday, as well as other hacking and helping videos. Thanks for watching.